Bank Act. If uh, the Arab in the West Bank and the occupied territories were refused, they refused to be expelled or to leave the country. Louder, louder, please, please. If the Arabs yes. in Israel refused to leave the country, yes. are you willing to massacre them? I haven't got the slightest fear that the Arabs will not want, will, will leave the uh, country or not leave the uh, country. Madam, 12 million Germans did not want to leave Poland and Czechoslovakia. When the army has the weapons and you don't have the weapons, you leave. You may not want to, but you leave. There will be no massacres. But don't you think they will all turn like Emelian and Emelian point three? would all turn against Israel, what you call them terrorists, they would be. How could you ensure the safety of one Israeli person one meter outside of Israel? In any airport? How do I ensure that now? Until Kahana came, there was no terror. It's only Kahana that threatens Israel with, with, Arab, with Arab terror. What kind of nonsense is that? First of all, when there are no Arabs inside Israel, one thing is guaranteed. There will be no bombs inside Israel. I go to funerals every, 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 every week in Israel. Those bombs and those bullets were not caused by Arabs in Lebanon, but by Arabs who live inside Israel. There will not be terror inside Israel. The question of terror outside Israel is not the, there, there won't be the slightest difference between Kahana or Abba Iben. So therefore, we expect terror, not only against Jews, but against many, many other peoples. We would hope that the world will deal with that terror. If Mayor Kahana would be there, I can assure you that Syria will, if Syria plans terror against Jews outside of Israel, Syria will feel terror 